Trivia Trial, our new LPL show where we take you through all the memes and all of the hidden spices of this league. I'm going to be your host, Clement Chu, and with me are my two lovely guests. Uh, yeah. yeah, and already the uh, the spiciest meme is how many times we've done this intro already. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> and I'm Dagda, I'm Dagda, good That's to be Dagda. here. Let's get going, <laughs> I'm ready to kick Joe's butt. <laughs> so here's... <laughs> We're going to talk about the format just a little. For each episode, we're going to ask five questions. Some of them will be subjective. Most of them will be multi-choice. And at the end of it, someone is going to come out with a higher point score. And on the next episode, there will be a forfeit. So someone has to eat something spicy or they have to do something really stupid at the start of the second episode. Stay tuned for that one. We're going to go straight (laughs) in. It's 100% going to be you. I'm not even... I'm. Yeah, I'm not even going to be here. Like, I'm I'm so confident. I'm just waiting for our punishment to arrive before I fly to Shanghai. That's how confident I am. I'm just like, I don't I'm not even gonna need it. Hey, when you guys that's, that's a lot of that's a lot of talk <laughs> for a future loser, my friend. When you guys come back, there's a lot of hot pots waiting for you, so I hope you get yourself prepared for that one. But we're gonna go into the I'll first question. Which of the two teams does War of the Dog and Pig refer to? This is a classic matchup between two LPL organizations, and you guys have to take turns. Give me your answers, starting with Joe. Well, I think RNG is the dog, and I think EDG is the pig? Is that your final answer? Are you sure RNG about that one? EDG? <laughs> I was until you asked if I was sure about it. Now you know what everyone feels on who wants to be a millionaire. Uh, IG is the pick. RNG versus IG. Okay, I'm going to have to go for Tadagna. What's your um, answer? So I'm going to say JDG because I know it's not It's not like... I think that's supposed to be a, 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 a well some sort of animal. I'm not entirely sure what. <laughs> so I'm going to go with JDG for one of them. And... Um, I don't know. Let's go. Let's go orangey because Uzi was called Puppy. So that's so JDG and orangey. We go with that one. All right. I don't know. The answer is <laughs> the answer is both of you are half right. You only got the dog part oh. correct, but you didn't get the pig part down, which is <laughs> I'm a little bit sad. That's a the G- JD Jing Dong Demon okay. Dog, by the way. I knew for, it was a uh, demon. I didn't know what type of animal it was. I was just like, yeah, I mean, look, it's a little scrunchy <laughs> little demon. That's as far as my thought process went. <laughs> but it has, oh, I don't know. I don't they know. put horns on the dog. Wait, it's so, hard. So well, what was the answer? The answer is actually EDG versus RNG. EDG because Clear Love is no... Oh, so I, had it. <laughs> I know, you, you <laughs> doubted yourself. <laughs> No! Just remember that. Remember that oh. when you're eating a hot pot, right? Just you were so close. You were just so close. <laughs> All right. So, so Uzi, Uzi is the puppy. What's the pig? The pig is Clear Love because Clear Love has been known as the uh, his fans has been known as as the piglets. Oh. So it's the war between the pig and the dog. It's a classic matchup. Whenever RNG and EDG uh, goes up, it's called in Chinese Zhu Gou Da Zha. So unfortunately, yeah. neither of you, you got make note that, of that one Joe, correct. So you can bring We're gonna move on. Broadcast next time, just the Chinese version. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> don't worry. Locked it. I don't want to say it now, uh, just okay, in case yeah. I embarrass you. But I'm, cheers, I'm cheers. gonna lock it. Don't worry. <laughs> Good start out to that one. For question two, which girl group did Flandre proclaim to watch a thousand times to give him the power over Nuggery? We did see EDG actually beat FPX in their first roundabout. And this is going to be a multi-choice question. Guys, this is about your K-pop knowledge. A, it's going to be Sistar. B, Wonder Girls. C, Twice. And D, G-Idol. Which of these K-pop groups is Flandre into? I'm going with Twice. I'm going with Twice because I I know they fill me with power and happiness and pride and everything that I need to take on the world. So I'm going to go with twice because <laughs> just that, like, if I listen to Likey Likey, I'm good for the day. I'm ready to go. My entire day has been made and I can just, whatever life throws at me, I'm ready with. So I'm going to go with twice. That's my answer for that. Uh, the only the only K-pop I know is uh, Bubble Pop and uh, Gangnam Style, <laughs> which I don't think really count. Um, 
But I'm pretty sure I saw this meme on Twitter or on Weibo. And I want to say it was, I think it was G Idol, but it might have been the third <laughs> one that said. I'm kind of torn. Can I phone a friend? I'm going to go with G Idol. And the answer is G Idol. The point does go Let's over go. to Cheated. Joe. Let's Robbed. go. First point. <laughs> stands with me. Let's first the twice I, stands. <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, my social media addiction is finally paying off. Uh, we did see Nuggery actually get an endorsement when he was at Worlds with oh, course, Dan yeah. Wong oh, yeah, that's from it. Wonder Girls. That one yeah. girl was wearing the t-shirt. Yeah. Exactly. He was hyping Nuggery up and Flandre felt like he ne needed a little bit of K-pop backup himself, but he went for G-Idol instead. So that point does go over to Joe. Now we are going to go into a stats question. Which player is not part of the 2000 Kill Club in the LPL? We're going to have four options right here. A, LWX, B, Uzi, C, Shahu, and D, Rookie. Which one is it going to be? I want, uh, since Dagda went first last time, this is going to be Joe going first this time. Uh, I believe it's LWX. Yeah, LWX. Ah, uh, both of you are correct here, so... Both of you get a point on this one. We just saw Shahu actually hit the 2k mark just a couple of days ago. <laughs> LWX has been the best slayer for multiple splits right now. He's currently sitting right behind Viper in that kill category as well. But on unfortunately, he only started uh, LPL since 2017. So still doesn't have that much time to catch up on the three other players. Well done, gentlemen. I'm super impressed by that one. Yeah, bad time I got one. <laughs> it's only because it was a recent topic that I know the numbers off the top of my head. But, yeah. Well done, well done. You should have said SMLZ. That would have made it harder. SMLZ yeah. is in the 2000s. That's club. why. That's why Don't it would have been harder. Man. <laughs> no, no, no. I wasn't dissing him. I was saying have him as one of the three that are in. Anyway. It doesn't oh. Matter. Okay. On. Okay. Okay. I. I think I kind Clement, of Clement, I think you're, you're doing, doing a great job as a host. Don't listen to M Munch. I think you're absolutely <laughs> wonderful. And honestly, I think you should I think you should can deduct we, points from just, Joe. I mean, can you imagine coming let's in just how think, horrible think that is? back to when this guy how was smack talking at the is. start, how confident he was, and now he's sucking up to the host because he's <laughs> losing. Let's just... Yeah. Oh, it's adorable. We do it's have adorable. subjective questions later on, so you can garner my favor. That is See, a I'm playing thing. the long game. But first, yeah. we have to go to... <laughs> Yeah, it's a smart one. First, we have to go to question four, and this actually comes out of a post-game interview, and this is, again, going to be a multi-choice one. Which team policy does Breathe attribute WE's 5-0 rise to? Option A is going to be escape room sessions with zero hints. Option B, fines for illegal plays during scrims. Option C, relaxing team twister <laughs> yoga. And option D <laughs> is going to be Best drafts in the league coming from coaching staff. Uh, I'm going to go with C just because that was oddly specific. <laughs> like, <that> I, <laughs> I, I, yeah, like, I want to I want to be different for the sake of competition. Yeah. But if it's not C, it's going to break my heart. I need the answer to be C on this one. <laughs> Yeah, and he's no twister yoga. yoga. Like specifically twister yoga. <laughs> twister yoga. Sorry. Twister <laughs> I've heard of hot yoga. I've heard of like is. some weird yoga. I have not heard of twister <laughs> yoga before. <laughs> oh, we just have okay. Alpro yoga. So, yeah. Unfortunately, C is not the correct answer. I put that in there oh. because Rogue Warriors actually did attribute some of their success in previous seasons into yoga sessions that the team had for them. But unfortunately, that was just a ruse. WE was not the one doing it. I'm going to give you both a second chance here. So, Dagda, what would your second oh. answer yeah, be? Yeah, can we repeat can, them? Can you repeat the other options? Okay, so A is going to be escape room sessions with zero hints. B is going to be fines for illegal plays during scrims. And D is best drafts in the league coming from coaching staff. So, I'm going to go with the escape rooms. Because I know they were kind of like talking a little bit about how they're, uh, they'd only kind of figured out partway through that they could actually play around three. So I feel like maybe the 5 0 wasn't from their drafts. <laughs> but yeah, let's go with escape rooms. We'll give it the escape rooms. Munch, your turn. I'm going to say it's the fines. I'm going to say that it's like a. Maybe they're not like big fines, but you get, you get punished for just inting scrims. 
because inting scrims is notorious <laughs> across the entire world in League of Legends. So I'd say maybe that is like the key to success. Congratulations to Joe. Oh, you actually no. got this one correct again. <laughs> Two one to Joe. Uh, this was done after. That's three one. Oh, surely that's three that's, one. Nah, it's two one for now. <laughs> hey, well, no, he's three. It's what? three one. Wait a minute, you just got a point <laughs> on. Hang on. Uh, <laughs> it is three one. Uh, wait a minute, but didn't both of you get LWS? Yeah, correct? and then he got first one and this yeah. one, right? Yeah. Oh yes. Wait, yes. why am I helping you? One. No, it's two one. It's two one. I, don't <laughs> I know forgot what about want, it but completely. I, I wasn't it. even giving track. In the name of honesty and justice. <laughs> I'm such a terrible But it is host. starting to get out of hand a little bit for you here, yeah. <laughs> Just I thought you were a robot. I thought you know these things. I under you underestimated how much you spend on Twitter. That's secretly. what I underestimated. <laughs> this one was, this one was uh, into it. So I actually put uh, escape sessions because that is something that the top esports did do. So it's an actual thing where teams try to do that to build team bonding. And uh, it did get dagged onto that one. I'm sorry for you, but illegal uh, fines for illegal plays is actually what WE did. They were a new team, and Breathe said that because each and every lane wanted to play super aggressive, so the coach instituted a fine. So they had to play around their jungler, and that made the team a lot more cohesive, and that gave them the 5-0 start this, in this the LPL. Finding your players. Yeah, this gauge all covered in heart. <laughs> <laughs> no more I like that this has happened play. to Breathe as well. He gets off OMG and is just like, let loose. He's just like, I gotta go. I'm off. I'm done. I'm ready to go. It's like, all right, no, they're fighting yeah. me. I gotta, I gotta go back in my box. <laughs> well, you know, I only prepared five questions. Oh, God. So, to be honest, oh, Joe, no. <laughs> you pretty much have already won this one already. <laughs> Unfortunately for Dagda, I well, actually we're gonna go Clement, remember you said question. that the last question counts as two points. Didn't you say? I'm pretty sure you said that. That was the, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. Get, see, remember? I can see that it's starting to tick over in your brain. There it is. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I I love how I love how you're you're such a nice guy, Rob. The the best you've managed to finagle yourself yeah. here is a tie. <laughs> yeah. Even if you get this, <laughs> see, like you could have just said three points. I'm a smart points, person because I know that I'm not going to be able to finagle the win, but I also know that I do better with spice than you. So, it's in Clement's best Is interest to, do, to get both of us screwed with the hot pot or the this hot sauce. And then he gets to enjoy both of us in misery. Wait, did we both lose it oh, as no. a tie? I, Shall well, we both win yeah. if it's a tie? I'm gonna, I, oh, I assume we both lose. All right, yeah. whatever. Bring it on. Bring on the final challenge. Bring it on. Two points. I'm happy <laughs> I want to beat him 5-1. <laughs> uh, this is where you try to garner favor from me. Very simple question. Who is your best player out of the first three weeks of the LPL and why? And I will give a point to the person I think it's has a better It's Carson because he's from the LMS, one of the greatest regions that have ever produced players. And if I know, if I know, Clement, he's all about the LMS. He's always been about the LMS. So... <laughs> I love how low you're willing to go. <laughs> There's no that was really barrier. good. Well done. Look, well played. My, sink well played. Is my <laughs> ship is sinking. I'm bringing Joe with me. This is, I've got nowhere else to go. I'm already on the sea floor. I just got to reach down and pull other people with me. <laughs> I don't think you can actually yeah, take sorry. Spice. I don't believe you. I'm pretty good with Spice. You're, you're getting You'd be some surprised. hot pot episode too. You'd be surprised. He's pretty good. He's pretty good. All right. All right. All right. Well, if Dag's just going to sink that low, I'm going to go to the AD carry position. I'm gonna talk about Betty. Now. <laughs> it's not even playing. <laughs> it's obviously Viper. Come on now, you can't even say any other player. The only other contestant, realistically, is oh. maybe Jackie Love for the one case I play. But Viper has been insane. Like every single game, this guy is popping off. He's clearly the best player in the league. He's statistically the best player in the league. I don't see no. any other possible argument, especially Carso, no, 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 who's no. in the middle of the table yeah. right now. What a ridiculous yeah, no. argument. Clement is a one trick at heart. And he is a Cled one trick at heart. And Doombie mm -hmm. is the only one that's brought out Cled in the LPL. So it has to be Doombie! It has to be Doombie! Yeah, Doombie. Your, final answer, your final answer is Casa. Uh, your final answer is Casa. What answer is Alright, I, I have to give this yes! one to Zagda. I like the way you play this game. What? You know, you're groveling to me. You're going into all my back history. That's exactly the way I want it. I love this contestant. <laughs> And also because it really doesn't matter, and Joe has won this episode. No, no, anyway. that brings us to that's, I think that the was best two player points. Was We're now three and three. We're now three and three. That's a tie. 
Clement's play That's by play was the real MVP. It's already been a warning. <laughs> so. No, nah, it's going to be a 3 2. Congratulations from Joe for sinking this one in. Cheated. I hope you guys That was supposed to be two points. That was supposed to be two points. I'm sorry, Dagger. That was only one <laughs> point. That was only one point. Job you should have fought harder right. and <laughs> enjoy the spice. In the first four episodes, <laughs> in the first four questions. But that's going to be all for our first episode. And please return with us to episode two, where we will have some spicy food to go down Dagda's throat.